What's going on guys and welcome to a new video and this is literally the first video that I've recorded for my own channel in over three weeks. So first of all, happy new year because like I said, you know, it has been a while. Um, let, let's just start at the start, you know, where have I been for the last few weeks? Literally the last video, um, I think it wasn't the Bangkok video, there's one more video after that and then after that I just stopped uploading on YouTube um, and just just after I said I wanted to start uploading three times a week and the reason for that is because last minute um, I got like the agreement um, to work on another project um, that had nothing to do with uh, social media marketing, nothing to do with my YouTube channel, anything like that but uh, long story short I had to record 100 videos um, about Facebook ads and just online marketing and media buying mostly um, with you know mainly Facebook ads, uh, Google ads as well and how you can basically earn money online through paid traffic. Um, for that it was like a very professional setup. I had to purchase a green screen and better lighting. I've obviously got my like, ring light around my camera now. Um, I needed a quick upgrade with that. Um, a softbox and like I said the, the, the green screen and uh, that didn't come till the 21st of December um, so I literally had 10 days to record 10 videos prior to that um, I was basically you know like mapping out what I wanted to say in the videos how to say it stuff like that you know what videos are going to be screen recordings what videos are just going to be pure value etc um, so the 21st of December, I got my green screen, I could set everything up. So from the 21st to the 31st of December 2019, I recorded 10 videos a day consistently, which uh, guys, if you've ever done YouTube or if you've got your own YouTube channel, you know how hard work it is to upload a video every single day, let alone 10. So literally, uh, it took me about four hours a day of recording. The videos weren't too long, like 10, 15 minutes each. And then from there, I had to edit all the videos. And I, funny enough, the long what took the longest was the uh, the exporting and uploading to you know the online portal. That just took so long. And obviously, you know, I, I've got an iMac from I think it's 2012, so it's eight years old, and it just couldn't handle it. I had to buy extra storage, so I've got a new uh, external hard drive as well. I had to get that because uh, we're talking about like two, 300 gigabytes of content here that I had to upload to an online portal. I had to also store it um, in my Final Cut Pro library as well because before it actually got uploaded, um, there's like a quick check from uh, basically who owns that company that I'm doing that project for. Um, so uh, he had to check it first give the head of content the green light, then he gives me the green light, and then basically from that point onwards, I could remove like the library from my computer. But before that, you know, uh, while I'm recording the videos, the library's just stacking up. So uh, anyway, it was a lot of fun. I, I would never do it again, not 10 videos a day anyway, um, but it was, you know, an experience. It was a good challenge. And uh, like I said, it wasn't anything to do with social media marketing. It was pure media buying. Um, I might get into it in a future video in a bit more depth and detail, but it's not really relevant for any of this. It was just a side project uh, that is now finished and I might continue with it um, on a smaller scale, but um, you know, obviously not on this channel or anything like that. So that was that. Um, other than that, obviously I've been working very, very hard on the coaching program and also my own agency. In terms of the client, uh, we've still got the big client. Again, I'm, it's unfortunate that I can't mention the name, um, but we've still got that big client. Um, when, I think it was around October, we landed two of the biggest clients that I've ever landed. One was um, that side project as well. It's basically make, like, sort of intertwined into that. And then there's one like big sort of like high tech consultant slash media buying client that we landed um, and what also made us get the office, I'm back in my home office now, as you can see, it's Saturday at the time recording this. Um, it's going well. We managed to basically bring out a case study um, that validates Facebook ads as a viable platform for them, which was the main goal for the first three months. So the first three months was test the waters, uh, managed to get the advertisements profitable, which we did. We managed to bring them over 18K in the last week uh, leading up to Christmas. Um, I think we got them over 342 conversions, all with a profitable CPA. Um, so that's good. 
you know, it's it's onwards and upwards from there. Now that we've validated it, we used Italy as a country to validate it in. Why? Because the cost per click is relatively low there. Uh, we got a lot of traction when we done the testing. Uh, we basically sort of like struck gold when we were testing a specific um, a specific like interest and image and we sort of got like a really high click through rate so we just decided to um you know focus on italy for the time being but the big challenge for us now will be uh, to validate it in the us um obviously the us um you know is a tier one country um a lot of potential and also a very large audience but you know obviously media buying is a little bit more expensive in the us so i'm ready for the challenge uh, we're just waiting for our green light in terms of the validation process we want to know whether we need to um, you know, follow the same process as we did in italy or do we basically just get free reign because it's a complete different country and we've already done the validation process of uh, validating if facebook is a platform that they want to use going forward um basically what they do is they've got an in-house google team which is just amazing that when you think about like literally just a whole section that does google and then we were brought in to do Facebook, uh, to test Facebook basically, uh, which we've done successfully. Um, so like I said, now it's onwards and upwards. In terms of my coaching program, everything's going well. Um, I love to see the results that the, the, basically the, my coaching students are getting. It's, it's not, not, it doesn't even feel like having coaching students. It feels like just having extra clients because I'm basically working on their business as well. So I'm helping them with their agencies, helping them getting started, helping them with the outreach, um, helping them with the, you know, the Facebook ads, setting it up, you know, making sure that uh, basically they will have a successful agency sooner rather than later. Um, I've been loving it, actually really, really been enjoying it. It's uh, fulfilling to see someone get results. Um, it's a different type of feeling as to a, um, an, like a, a business, uh, as a client because um, a business is already up and running and I feel like now I'm at the start of these people's businesses and I'm just helping them you know get started I'm giving them advice and I'm basically showing them what I've learned in the past pass it on to them and it's just it's just been a great experience so far so hopefully I can continue to do that and provide as much value as possible uh, to everyone which is also sort of intertwined into my 2020 resolutions and goals I thought about it for so long and it's basically going to be the same as last year you know it's i'm not going to do any type of new year's resolution um i just want to continue on the path that i was on last year and just basically you know improve incremental improvements every single day every single week every single month and basically you know continue to live life on my own terms as much as i possibly can obviously you know there are financial goals and there's investment goals in terms of real estate and also you know purchase on my own house and stuff like that but other than that it's literally just I continue on the path that I'm already on and that, you know, also help as many people as possible live out life on their own terms, whether that is through my own YouTube channel, through my free products, through my paid products, through my training program, my coaching program, you know, regardless, if I can help as many people as possible, then that is, you know, a job well done for me. In terms of, I think that was about it, actually. Um, what have we had? We've had the coaching, we've had the clients, we've had the resolutions, We've had why I wasn't uploading on YouTube. Um, I think that's what I was there, actually. In terms of what I want to do with the channel going forward, just to finish it all off, obviously, I will be back now on YouTube. I will be posting more frequently because, basically, now that I'm, I'm filming for myself again rather than for um, a client-slash-collaboration um, business. Um, so I will be trying to upload more frequently um, I want to focus mainly on obviously social media marketing, but also a lot on Facebook ads, media buying, and how you can basically get results for clients that you've got, or also use media buying, social media, um, to get results for yourself as well. So uh, that is basically what I'm focusing on. That is what the plan is for this year. Um, I do have a bit of an, not necessarily an announcement, but um, a change of heart in terms of what platform I prefer. Obviously, I'm very, very active on Instagram. I try and get as many people on as possible to follow me on Instagram, but I have noticed that over time, it's getting a bit stale. And I think that I wanna focus on YouTube more from now on. So, um, you know, for those of you that follow me on Instagram, 
you will notice a slight drop in my you know, me producing content basically for Instagram and you will notice an increase on YouTube. For those of you that don't only follow me on YouTube, well, you know, there's nothing really changes for you guys. Anyway, you'll just be seeing more uploads of me. So anyway, that is it for today. Like I said, um, you know, I hope you enjoyed this video. I will be back now with more content more than ever, hopefully. Um, for those of you that do need help with the agency or want to help, uh, you know, want have like coaching or guidance when getting started with an online business then make sure you look into the description box down below you can schedule either a free call to see if it's a right fit for you if you're unsure or on the fence about it or if you want to get started and you basically want to hit the ground running in 2020 you can sign up for my coaching program you will get personal access to me via whatsapp you will also get personal access to the whatsapp group where everyone is like-minded and on the same journey you'll get personal access to the private facebook group my online course and also the weekly group coaching course so all that good stuff is all linked in the description box down below subscribe to the channel for more and i'll see you guys in the next one